Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mario, also known as Soul Style Beauty. And we are all in this together, y'all. We're all in this together. Once we know that we are, we're all stars and we see that. We know exactly what time we're in right now, so I'm not even gonna say it. Um, but I wanted to do this video on how I've been coping, dealing with the new work from home type situation quarantine not leave your house situation um and i really wanted to just do a sit down chill video i never really do videos in my room so this is my room <laughs> so i have my clothing rack in the back um but this is just a video not to tell you how you feel because that is something that is just cringe worthy to me um everybody lives different lives we're all affected in different ways we all cope in different ways so this is just a sit down video to just talk you know so let me know down below how you guys are feeling how y'all living as far as me like i said i've been home ain't nowhere to go y'all um and i'm just taking each day as it comes so sometimes i might have like a wonderful day where i'm like this is amazing like i feel great i'm on tiktok yes i'm on tiktok y'all um i've been doing my makeup because i just feel like it um i've been on instagram sometimes a little bit too much on instagram so i'm not on there at the moment um i've been watching a lot of netflix so I just have it like I'm just taking each day day by day so yeah y'all I have my notebook here because oftentimes I do forget things and it's so annoying to go back and edit and I'm like yo Imari just just bring a notebook write things down okay and stop trying to commit things to memory because I have a horrible memory um so yeah so one way I've been dealing with this whole work from home situation new life is just renewing my mind that's what the word says renew your mind daily i'm trying not to check my phone i'm trying not to have every message bombard me at every second so a lot of my messages are on do not disturb and there's no offense to anybody but sometimes you have to take certain measures to just protect yourself. I feel like we have a lot of information coming at us from Instagram, um, Snapchat, Twitter, not really Snapchat, but Twitter. And we don't really like I just think it's so dangerous at times to just take everything for at like, you know, take all this information. Um, so I've been really trying to be in the word Psalm 91, God's protection all over my life. And I'm just so grateful that we could do that anytime, any minute, any day. Just like I need my mind renewed daily, every second, if it could be. <laughs> so that's what I've been doing. Um, another thing that I've been doing is just like making sure I show gratitude or have gratitude every single day. It's certain things that we took for granted, such as A, going outside. In my neighborhood, I have this pier, um, and I've been walking there or whatever, just because I know I just need some fresh air. But usually, I don't go there for anything. It's a beautiful pier, but I'm just like, oh my gosh, like I literally took this for granted. Like, But it really made my day, like just practicing gratitude and just sharing things that you're thankful for. Like we have tons of time to reflect. So like I know my job is something where I'm like, dad, thank you God, like that I have a job that I'm taking, making money. Some people, they don't have jobs, they're laid off. And if that is you, like I'm so praying for you um, because I know what it's like to feel like you're in a financial burden, you know? So um, practicing gratitude has definitely helped me. Um, next, I've been showing myself grace daily like sometimes i'm like yay imari i want to be productive and you should be doing this project and you should be working on this and you should be filming every day but then i'm like if i'm not in the mood to do that i'm not going to do that because like i said each day i'm taking each day as it comes and some days i don't feel like filming some days i don't feel like being productive um and i'm really trying to lay down that superwoman complex that a lot of us have during this time like we should be doing something and being productive at all times and our value is in our work and i'm just like no you know i am a youtuber but then i'm also a human and i want to make sure that i'm making the right choices for me you know so i've been really trying to um show myself grace you know if you don't want to film me 
that's cool. If you want to film, if you want to beat your face and <laughs> play around on TikTok, do you. Like, whatever you feel comfortable doing, do that, okay? Just as long as we're in God's will. The next thing I've been doing is playing music, y'all. Music is like my therapy. It is so like my therapy, y'all. So I have some songs. Um, It's a mix. So I love soca music. I love gospel music. I love R&B. Um, yeah, those are like my three main genres that I really listen to that I love, 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 love. So I'm going to play a few snippets of a song that you might like or you might have heard of. But these songs literally just make my day. Like make my day so yeah y'all if you know me you know that Janae Aiko is one of my favorite artists of all times like she's one of my faves so she just came out with an album and I've been loving this song called love like Oh, that song just does it for me. Like, <laughs> I love that song. Um, I also like a song called Optimi Op Optimistic. That song always, always, always lifts my spirits. As far as gospel, I've been loving the song called Amen um, by Charity Gale. She's a gospel singer and I love her. Truth and the light. Perfect. Save God. Also been loving the whole album of the miseducation of Lauren Hill like that song this whole that whole album like if you don't like that album I don't know I, don't, I just don't know why I just don't <laughs> like that album this whole album is amazing so y'all clearly I love music so I'll leave some um, of my songs that's been lifting my spirit in the um, description box down below uh, but yeah music is like a huge part of my life it's the reason why me and my fiance actually click like he's a musician he likes the same music or some of the most of the same music that I like um, so I love music um, but lastly how I've been dealing with this and most importantly is just prayer like I don't think we know how powerful prayer is and it doesn't even have to be out loud in words like God hears us regardless if we're speaking it out loud or if we're crying if we're groaning like and I think that's the, the thing that we need to realize is we don't have to be in a perfect position for prayer and that's one thing that I'm so grateful to God about like we don't have to be you know as that doesn't have to be a certain time of day it doesn't have to be in a certain position um, but he's always there listening to us so I just pray that everybody out there who watches my channel like you're truly um, okay and like taking each day day by day and staying safe and taking the proper precautions um to keep you and your family safe like this too shall pass i'm not going to tell you guys how to feel but i hope that you were encouraged by every single thing that i've been doing in my life right now that's helping me deal um with things and make sure that you monitor like the information that's coming at you i think that's very important we have a whole bunch of like false facts that spread um and just information daily you know that's on instagram twitter like we don't need to see all of that like it's okay to turn your phone on do not disturb it's okay to delete instagram for a day or two just to renew your mind or just to clear all distractions you know so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video more to come and i'll see you in my next one later y'all